Hey guys, David Romans here. Welcome to my channel. Today I'm going to start designing the characters for my book. So uh, in my book series, if, not, if you're not familiar with it, Eternal Horizon, like I have a cast of characters of, uh, it's like a Shakespearean, I got this thing for a Shakespearean play, you know, like how they introduce a cast of characters in the beginning. And I know some people suggested I should start it in the beginning, but I have them at the end of the book because they're not really necessary. You know, you can read the book without even looking at them. It's just like a guide. You know, I got this idea from a video game booklets. You know, like, oh, they have the characters there. I'm going to design my own characters. So anyways, yeah, I'm going to start designing my characters. And today I'm going to do um, Valiant or Lombardo. He, uh, he's mentioned in the first three books. Well, actually, he, he's a character in the third book. But he's mentioned in the first two books. And uh, the, he's a central character of book four. He's one of the main characters of the whole story, probably second after Vincent. But, you know, there are others, but whatever. So yeah, how I'm gonna do this. I already have the sketch right here. I started out by looking at a little mannequin, a little sketch, and I have a little design going there. But it's, it's nothing for now. I mean, I'm gonna Photoshop this. And when I Photoshop this, I'm not gonna just digitally draw it. Some parts, yes, I'm gonna digitally draw, but other parts, I'm gonna do uh, photo manipulation. I'm gonna grab like fabric, like leather or whatever, and just shape it up, make it look nice, make it look decent. And you know, some people told me before, oh, why can't you just draw it? You're cheating. You know what? Eat it. <laughs> Pardon my French. Eat a fuck. It's art, all right? You know, you know there's dudes out there. The, the freaking little, they cut out magazine ads, you know, and just slap them together, create a collage, and sell that crap for like $500. I've seen that shit displayed in galleries. Freaking magazine ads, they cut them out, and they put a collage, you know, and if you call that art, and you, you know, and you have the audacity to call this cheating, you know, with photo manipulation, whatever, man. And so I'm going to show you the whole process. I'm starting with Valiant today, the main character. I'm going to do all 20 plus characters. Probably won't be an introductory video like right now, but here we go. See the process? Please subscribe. Book 4 coming out 2021. Book 1 to 3 are available on Amazon and Kindle. Print format is the best. You know, I have all the book illustrations, chapter illustrations. Alright, so I have my character here. The illustrations are, uh, my book is 5x8. So, I did it by inches but it doesn't matter you know because I'm gonna move around the character and I'm probably gonna shrink it down just to escape the bleeding part or whatever when I do it for print so yeah this is pretty much a skeleton you see how blurry it all is it's pretty much a skeleton it's pretty much the frame and what I'm gonna do is I have all of these characters that I built for the first three books and maybe I'll take a leg here, leg there, arm here, arm there, and just like layer over this guy. And I even already have his face ready. I painted him before. So, you know, I'm just, I'm cutting through the BS. I'm cutting through the old crap and I'm building my characters. So I'm going to fast forward some of this, but I'm pretty much like, I'm not drawing him yet. I'm just slapping his skeleton together using already pre-made templates. So let's start. Then I'm, gonna get, I'm gonna get his face last. Okay, let's get his legs first. His legs, Lysander looked good. I'm gonna get Lysander. And I'm gonna get Lysander's legs. And m maybe torso too. I could even, well actually, Probably do the whole torso and nah, I'll do the torso L from, from another guy. Let me get his legs first. Oh, I don't like this leg. I like. Oh, do I like this leg? Yeah, let, let me just get this leg. See what happens.
see what we got here. Okay, now all I have left is his face. And, um, I'm barely, I mean, I might give him a smile or some shit. Probably a decent sized head. There we go. Make the black and white. Maybe, uh. And then you know, later on, I'm just gonna do, you know, something like this. And, like, maybe, uh, you know. Okay, I'm gonna leave the head alone. You know what? Hold on a second. Let me just completely remove his neck. Okay, let's do another, another layer here. And this one is going to be pure white. Kind of like, you see, what we're working with here. Alright. Let's start. Messing around with the tool. Let's, first of all, let's connect the missing points. You know, I do that I'm gonna make everything one solid color like this
He had some daggers, a blaster, and his sword. And we should be done. Let's find his sword. Okay, you know, and I have his sword in actual in a painting. So let me see if I have Okay, as far as the handle goes. As far as the handle goes. Let me grab Lysander, because Lysander used to have the sword before it was passed down. Well, actually it wasn't passed down, but Lysander got chapped up. And technically, Lysander's son, Cezanne, gave it to us. Well. Start from the bottom, now we're here. Here we are. Now I'm not gonna talk through the other ones. I'm gonna just record my process. Actually, you know, I still gotta do his belt buckle. But yeah, I'll do that real quick, but I'm pretty much done. Pretty much done. And uh, please subscribe. You're gonna slap this on and the video is done.